Hey you guys, today I decided to release the second part of the video about a 5 coin portfolio. I remind you that here you will see the coins that I would buy right now if I didn't have any cryptocurrency at all. These coins will come from different narratives and have varying risk-reward ratios, but I plan to make the portfolio as balanced as possible. This approach allows for maximum profit with minimal risk of total loss. I promise this video will be extremely useful, so subscribe to the channel and hit the like button and let's get started. Before we move on, I want to remind you that this video is not financial advice. It's just my opinion and market analysis. So do your own research and invest wisely. I've talked about Solana many times on my channel, one of the largest and most interesting blockchains right now. We bought it when few believed in it, but over time, it turned out that we were spot on we saw the real potential of this amazing token very early. Despite all the pros of Ethereum, right now I much prefer Solana. Unfortunately, the largest altcoin faced significant overvaluation just before the launch of spot Ethereum ETFs, which led to disappointment among investors. Meanwhile, Solana has been gaining momentum, showing growth. Moreover, it has become a real hub for the biggest current market narrative, meme coins. Tens of thousands of coins are launched here every day, with people becoming millionaires or, conversely, losing all their savings. Solana is where PumpFun emerged, a breakthrough platform for anyone who wants to create their own memcoin. This project changed the game, bringing crazy trading volumes and even crazier profits for its founders. More than 2.5 million tokens have been created and the platform's total profit amounts to nearly 985,000 Solana coins, which at the current exchange rate is $163 million. These are staggering figures, and all this liquidity is currently on Solana. So it's not hard to imagine how many users are now using the blockchain, how much the blockchain earns, and how fast the entire ecosystem is growing given these factors. Moreover, there's still a chance for the approval of spot Solana ETFs, which will likely benefit the project. In the US, Solana has much greater support than Ethereum. Additionally, we can see how large the project's community is and how often they organize various events to attract new users, projects, and initiatives. Considering all these pros, I can't help but expect to see impressive returns from current levels with a potential for really high values at the market peak. Here, I decided to add two assets at once as I removed the RWA narrative to increase the share of AI tokens in the portfolio. Let's start with a big and very interesting AI project. It's a true revolution in the world of decentralized machine learning. Imagine a global network where every neuron is a machine learning model owned by different people worldwide, all working together to process information and provide intelligent solutions. It's like how our brain works with neurons helping us think and make decisions. So, what makes TAO so special? TAO is the native token of the BitTensor network, which serves several key functions. It incentivizes network participants, like miners who provide their computational resources to complete machine learning tasks by rewarding them with TAO tokens. To become a miner and earn rewards, participants must stake their TAO tokens. But that's not all. TAO also plays a significant role in network governance. Token holders can propose changes, vote on protocol updates, and participate in important decision-making processes. Users who need machine learning services can pay for them with TAO tokens, creating a real marketplace for computational services. This means TAO has enormous potential to become a crucial asset in the rapidly growing field of decentralized AI services. This will not only increase the token's value, but also establish BitTensor as one of the leading players in the AI and blockchain space. A great example is that many projects are being built on TAO's subnet. I've compiled a whole selection of such coins, which you can find on my channel to discover assets that interest you. Moreover, the globally renowned fund Grayscale decided to create a separate fund for AI crypto projects, including TAO, where it allocated the largest share, almost 30%, at the moment, BitTensor's market capitalization is $3.8 billion, but given the project's development pace, we could see $40 billion by 2025. That's a potential 10x growth. Now, 
As we prepare to move on to the next token, drop a comment with your thoughts on TAO. If you've already left a comment, let's move on to the next fascinating small project. Akash Network is flying under the radar of all the DGENs. It's a real crypto competitor to giants like Google Cloud and Amazon Web Services, and its main advantage is offering cheaper and more favorable conditions for users. One huge plus is that their services are significantly cheaper than traditional providers. As you can see from the charts, Akash offers much more attractive prices for its services, which is the key driver of its growth. But that's not all. Akash Network operates like a marketplace where you can rent out your GPUs and earn passive income. This means anyone can become part of the Akash ecosystem and profit from their hardware, making the project even more appealing to both users and investors. Additionally, they are actively developing their ecosystem, offering simplified ways to integrate into the Akash network, allowing even more people to join the project. The working use cases they've already implemented only increase trust in the project and give more confidence in its future growth. The GPU theme looks extremely bullish, and many experts predict parabolic growth in this market in the coming years. This is one of the reasons Akash Network looks so attractive to investors. Personally, I expect Akash to at least reach the recent peak levels of Render Network in the short term. What do you think about this project? Is it needed even with Render already on the market? The next asset in our selection is the funny meme coin, Smoking Chickenfish. It stands out from typical memes and grabs attention with its absurd name and imagery. Its market capitalization currently stands at $52 million. I first mentioned this token when it had a market cap of $32 million, and after that, we saw it reach $140 million. The project is actively promoted on social media and its website using famous memes and cultural references. Their logo, for example, is a still from a movie that became a global meme. Regarding more crypto-specific indicators, trading volumes are quite decent, firmly establishing a good level. I expect Smoking Chickenfish to reach the capitalization level of the well-known GigaChad meme. A very important sign is that even the famous crypto figure Arthur Hayes supports this meme coin. However, please be very cautious. Meme coins are an extremely risky area of cryptocurrency. They offer easy gains but also come with significant risks, so keep that in mind. Share in the comments what you think about such unconventional meme coins. And now, let's move on to the last token in this selection. The final token is the Project Masa. Masa is building a leading decentralized network for AI and large language models. Users can own, share, and monetize their data and computational resources to run AI applications. Although similar projects already exist, like Theta Network, Masa stands out with its innovative solutions. Masa's analytical data is used by well-known projects like Near Protocol, Polygon, and the cryptocurrency exchange OKX. Moreover, the project has a separate direction that helps other teams launch their own products, tokens, and so on. There's already a large list of teams that have used these services, including Base and Injective. Personally, I believe that Masa shows great potential for growth thanks to support from leading market players and the opportunity to capture a market share from Theta Network. Currently, Masa's market capitalization is $23 million. Considering the high level of utilization of all the project's features and support from major market players, as well as the opportunity to gain a share of Theta Network's market, Masa could grow by 40 to 60 times, reaching an approximate market cap of $1.5 billion. Let me know what you think. And that's all for now. I want to remind you that this video is not financial advice in any way. These are just my thoughts and views on the market, so you should always do your own research before investing and do it wisely. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on the growth of these coins. Thanks for watching, your coin post.